hey, what's going on? Orlando sent me this text saying that we should all get together since it's been a while. <laughs> and the bartender came and picked me up himself. What gives? Yeah, I'll explain that in a second. But first, thanks for coming. <sighs> so where is everyone? Why is it just us here? I had Orlando text you. I wanted to talk with you myself. But you wouldn't answer any of my calls. <sighs> so, what is it? It's over. I don't want to talk about it. Don't you get it? Yeah, I do. I need to tell you something. Why am I putting up with this? <sighs> Vincent. <sighs> what is it? This is your last chance. It was all an illusion. Huh? What was? My cheating. Huh? There never was another woman. Are you kidding? I'm not gonna believe that. I know it's hard to believe, but I'm telling you the truth. I never cheated on you. <laughs> Don't be stupid. I'm serious here. I was losing it, and, and I thought I was cheating. I know, I know, it all sounds like bullshit. I was driving myself crazy, too. I mean, I mean, that's a problem in of itself, but... Hey, are you serious? It's all true. My friends and the boss here showed me that it was all in my head. You don't expect me to believe this. No. I just didn't want it to end with a misunderstanding. That's why I had you come here. No, that can't be true. Then that means because of that, we... You're lying. It's not a lie. Johnny, Orlando. Long time no see, Kay. Sorry. Don't sweat it. It'd be hard for anyone to believe a story like that at first. <laughs> yeah, well, we didn't believe it either until we heard from Erica. Huh? Besides, if this fool really did cheat on you, well, we wouldn't help him out like this. Um... About the... illusion. Allow me to explain. You? What the heck? What's going... You see... It's all true. Please, believe me. <laughs> Catherine. Let's give him some time. It may have been fake, but in my heart I was still cheating on you. I'm sorry. I know you can't forgive me for what I've done. <laughs> no, I can't. I finally woke up. <laughs> I was worried about how my life was going. I thought everything was being decided for me. I was being tossed about by the world. I had so much stress. <laughs> but after you dumped me, I figured it out. My life has no meaning without you. Why are you telling me this now? So I'll never regret not telling you. I will hold you dear for the rest of our lives. Will you marry me? <sighs> Catherine, I love you. This is so sudden, I... I don't mean now. Someday. That's not what I meant. I guess 
I'll consider it. You... you'll consider it? I... Uh, this is wonderful. Just wonderful. Hey, hey, what are you getting worked up about? Besides, I can't believe... I know, I can't either. This is perfect. What? Jeez. That is... I can barely believe this myself. It's nice to be able to see you again. How'd you enjoy the show? A perfect escape from the terrifying nightmare. You led Vincent out with your exceptional skills. Even Astaroth, the mastermind behind the nightmares, was amazed. Did you happen to notice the central conflict that this game's masterful creators placed at its core? Do you want to live a comfortable and steady life? Or do you secretly long for a free life, full of excitement? In the nightmare, Astaroth said that there is no right way to climb the tower. The stairway Vincent was forced to climb could be taken as a metaphor. It symbolized the journey to adulthood, pressuring him to make his tough life decisions. Don't you agree? And the finale. Mm. Vincent begging his lover to come back to him. I hung on every word, wondering how she would react to his desperate plea. She was at a loss as Vincent poured his heart out to her. But in the end, she answered him with a smile. <laughs> if you ask me, I'd say she's a bit too forgiven. But this is the answer Vincent discovered after forging through his nightmarish ordeal. Catherine must have felt the strength of his conviction, and she knew that this was his true answer. Maybe it depends on how much of Vincent's feelings that she can sense. You think that could be what determines the future for those two, hmm? Hey, tell me. What did you players out there think of this outcome? I sure do hope their second chance works out. Mm. Ah, they'll be all right, won't they? So are you worried about them? Mm. Cause I know I am. Well, let's peer a bit into their future together, shall we? <laughs> Games are lovely creations, aren't they? Hope to see you soon. Stay golden. What design I should go with? I mean, I really don't wear white all that often. You think it'll look good on me? You look good in anything. You know that. <laughs> right. Oh, have you decided who you're going to invite to the wedding? Hmm? I've already picked out everyone that I want. Oh, you did? I told you to think about it. S sorry. I'll, uh, I'll do that right now. Now, what's left? Uh, hey, baby. Let me see. Think you could, uh, get off. Ooh, and you're this up one. Crushing hmm. me. Oh, that's so pretty. I can't pick. I need to think. Oh. <laughs> well, that wasn't me. <laughs> hey, you want to go grab a bite? I could go for a bite, but think about who you're inviting, okay? I know, I know. You want to go to the usual place then? Let's hurry then before they run out of lamb kebab. Up and at them, huh? Ah! Okay, I got it. So just move and I can. <laughs> huh? What? <laughs> You're the one who's being Mr. Lazybone.